Hello YouTube and good morning. How the devil are you? Saturday is the 20th of January. It's fucking freezing cold and we've got another storm coming in. So plenty of wind and rain. Perfect. Just what we want there. Right then, this is a video. Uh, obviously I was involved in the Club 52 challenge last year. I've got to do an update on how many games I completed now. But this video is Again, about the Club 52, but it's got a little group, WhatsApp, Google Me Chops, and I mean, people have been putting in here about 10 games they want to finish, or games they want to finish this year. And I just thought I'd make a little video on it. That's all saying, um, I said, I'd love to get the 52. I know it was a very, very good chance that I won get the 52. I've done three so far this year, but they're just quick, quick games. Um, well, what I suppose. About two hours, two and a half hours. I don't know whether you class that quick. I class that as quite quick, but the other two were half hour and 40 minutes, so that's proper quick games. Anyway, it's just 10 games year now that I've got that I want to complete this year. Some of them I've never completed before. Um, two I have. One can't remember the last time I completed it in that version because it is uh, hard as nails towards the end and it's up today it's the original Wonder Boy on the Master System so I am looking forward to getting into that because I'm obviously not getting into it <laughs> I love Wonder Boy but hopefully uh, completing that so that's definitely one on the list and again it's in no particular order guys just I thought I'd chuck it on there and so I think if I put it on there I'm sort of not obliged because obviously we do what the fuck we want can't you? you can say I wanted to complete this the way don't do it you don't do it don't make no fucking difference but I think if I make a video on it it'll probably encourage me to to do it I know yeah I've got to tuck my uh things in because of the puppy puppy likes going after him so we all just keep trying to tuck out laces it now she's a turd but yeah anyway next one up again one i have completed and it was when it first came out and i do really enjoy this game i think i'm sure i done one two three and judgment last year or if it wasn't last year it was definitely about 18 months ago and four number four is it's a drag number four is but i do like years five so yeah looking forward to playing through that again it's already installed on the xbox one so yeah that's that one right next one up i'll say because it's digital i don't own it but i downloaded it in the sale thanks to dylan popping a thing in the group saying about um about the switch sale and that's android to nos tour so yeah i've had a couple little goals on it so far it's um it's all right it's more all right actually it's really pretty good so yeah see what i can do with that um next one up i know this is going to be hard as nails i have started i think i've done two yeah two of the bosses yeah definitely two so i need to get back into this and that's Agalos. now i know this does get really stupidly hard so hopefully i can do that that's that one. One which I can't wait to play through. And that is Fall of the Foot Clan. Now I played through this. Oh, so it's another one. No, have I finished it? I'm not sure if I finished it actually. I might have. But if it was, it was a long, long time ago. That is all called Herbias 007. So yeah, looking forward to playing through that again. Fall of the Foot Clan. Next one up, another Game Boy title. I had this recently off Craig, Goodwin's Place, and I oh, can't wait to get stuck into this. And that is Super Mario Land. If you can focus. Probably not, but anyway, you won't know what that looks like. Now, yeah, really looking forward to getting into that. Right, next one up is one, funny enough, I bought this when I was out with Craig and Matt. I said I love the Zelda series. There's some that obviously I like a lot more than others. 
It wouldn't be a video unless I yawned. So I've done a bit of overtime this morning, so I'm a little bit tired. <laughs> um, yeah, I've never played this one before. But looking at it there in my like little plastic box, I've got the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword Collector's Edition thing. Now, obviously, that would have been for the Wii. And yeah, for the Wii, so I'll have to flick through that as well before I play this. And I'll sell the Skyward Sword. So, yeah. I hear some people really like this and some people in our fastness, so yeah, I'll play it and make my mind up, see what I think of it. That's that. Right, here's one. I only ever finished this game on the the Switch version. I can't ever remember, I don't think. Well, I'm pretty 99% sure that I didn't do the arcade version because on the arcade version once you get the last level you get five continues and it's really hard but this is a different it's very similar but it's different if that makes sense so yeah i want to finish play through toki on the mega drive have that little bit of artwork there look toki goes ape spit yeah remember right when i was a kid my mate had this and because i love the arcade version so much he didn't like this. I said, oh, go on, I'll buy it off you. And I think we agreed a price of, I think it was about £20. And it worked on it because I was going to give him like £5 each week. And I think I give him a fiver and I say, oh no, I don't want it. So give me the fiver back and I give him the game back. And I think it happened about three or four times. And in the end, like, and we still got afraid, he didn't get pissed off about it. Because um, he just used to chuck the money in like a pot and leave it. So, yeah, quite surprised he didn't actually get pissed off about it. Because he was like, other stuff was coming out, or he'd want money, you know, to do different things. And I said, oh no, I don't want it now. But yeah, I'm so happy to have this in the collection. Anyway, little story there, a talkie. All right, here's one. I think I'm up to about Will's. they've just done the, the first mine carts and this i know it's gonna frustrate me it's gonna be hard as nails and it's another one i had off craig goodwin and it was in uh, the Ars, argos sale sorry and that's donkey kong country returns 3d now this is a brilliant game i haven't played it for a good couple of months so i think i might start a new game and just do like one or two levels just to get back the feeling then go back Oh, sorry, I'm boring myself. Oh, and then go back to my other save. Sure, I can do that. Yeah, so that's Don Kong Country 3D. Next one up, and it's the last one, isn't it? One, two, three, four, sorry. Yeah, it's the last one. Now, I know I've never played this one, but I love, love this game. And I've been doing like a couple of so I got it on my um, modded PSP on a disc on it. Not this fucking SD card, sorry. And I see we do one or two levels, like, like when we go on holidays or something like Saturday airport do it. And then just never carry on. So I'm going to make a conscious effort to play through this this year. And that's the original GTA. So yeah, I fucking love this game. So good. And like I said, so many memories playing that. Remember again, and me and my mate being shocked, like, will you steal your first car? <sighs> oh, God. Okay, now. Cream crackered. Yeah, anyway. So that's uh, GTA, the original GTA. Still looking forward to get stuck into that. So, right then. Yeah, that's 10 games I want to finish this year. I'm not saying I'm going to do the 10 of them. Or one after another. Not even going to say I'm going to complete the 10 of them. But I'd like to complete them. I'm going to make a good effort to complete them. And a few other games hopefully. So uh, yeah. Anyway cheers for watching guys. Hope you all have a great weekend. And I hope it's not too bad where everyone is. Fingers crossed. So yeah. All the best. And catch you in the next one.